We've had Grayson since he was a baby. He's the toughest child I, I, that I've ever seen. He's much more of a man th than I'll ever be um, when you think about what he's come through. We're bringing the potential for hearing to a child who can't hear and had no other options. The surgery is done through an incision behind the ear. We remove a small window of bone, and then we go down, and there's a natural fold in the brain or, or plane between the, the surface of the brain and the bone, and we're able to open that plane up uh, with a little bit of patience and find our way down until we come to the brain stem, and we can see the normal nerves that are present. We can also see where the missing nerve would be if it was there, but of course we're able to confirm that that nerve is not there. And then in the brain, there's a little pocket that leads inside the brain, a fluid space inside the brain. That's called the ventricle. And right on the floor of that ventricle is an area called the cochlear nucleus. That's where the brain normally gets information from the ear. But in, in this child's case, there's no nerve to bring that information. So we take a small paddle or electrode and we lay it directly on that area. And then there's a cable that comes right out beside the brain, through the covering of the brain, through the bone, and then coils under the skin and hooks up to the receiver. So, we want to talk to him in a normal voice, not too loud. Um, he may want to whip it off again. I wouldn't be surprised if his first response was whoa, because this is going to be much more complex sound than what he's been listening to. Grayson, talk to him, Daddy. Daddy loves you. Daddy <laughs> loves you. Daddy. Yes, here. Can you hear Daddy? Get in his, get in his face. Daddy loves you. I've never Daddy. seen a look like that today. I mean, he looked deep into my eyes, and uh, he was hearing my voice for the first time. It was, it was phenomenal. It was just absolutely phenomenal to, to see him take that sound in and try to figure out what in the world is this. I've never had this sensation before. Seeing him respond, that had a lot of, a lot of feelings for me. I mean, I felt like there was the potential that we were affecting, you know, changing the world in some ways. 